What's been happening here at Aguacate Airfield is we're part of a major multinational relief effort. So we have been working with USAID and as well as other non-governmental organizations to provide humanitarian aid and disaster relief alongside our partners here in Honduras. We've been working with the Honduran military as well as COPECO, their disaster response administration, to provide assistance and aid to some of the communities that were hardest hit by the recent hurricanes. Some of the challenges that we uh, encountered along the way are uh, really related to our sustainment of the force. It's a significant challenge to get fuel for these helicopters and uh, due to some of the damage uh, during the hurricanes, uh, some of our supply lines were uh, deteriorated. Uh, therefore, that presented some challenges, um, but the Wing Warriors did execute a convoy that took uh, a little more than 12 hours to bring fuel to the fight to continue to provide aid to the local community. So some of the challenges we've run to along the way is just how isolated most of the affected population is here in Honduras. So we in the DOD have some unique capability to overcome those obstacles. We've been using our helicopters to assist them in providing humanitarian aid and assistance to those isolated communities who have been affected by the recent hurricanes. What these efforts have done is reinforced our commitment to the Honduran people and our ties with the Honduran military. We've maintained a positive working relationship and a partnership for about 40 years here in Honduras. And it's very heartwarming and, and brings us a lot of pride to be able to come together and to assist them in responding to this in their time of need. 